Dear Bubba, something you always taught me that I remember is live in the moment. Every day's a blessing, and that's why it's called the present. But some days, I just wish I could turn back the clock. Not so I can change anything, but just so I could feel it all over again. I don't know what it is about the past. That just feels so comfortable. <laughs> I still remember how you used to drop me in the center of the swimming pool so that I would learn to paddle my way back to you. Trust me. With the amount that I used to cry, I could easily fill a pool with my tears. But today, I'm independent, strong, and fierce. And Mama, if you happen to be sneakily reading this, just know that you're my rock and I love you so much. I've made so many friends at college this semester, it's ridiculous. But I have to tell you about Aish. I mean Aisha. Baba, we're literally two sides of a coin. If she's Sita, then I'm Gita. And if she's Tina, then I'm definitely Anjali. At first, I didn't like her very much but she's so nice. Not very Bollywood, but don't worry, I'll change that soon. She'll be doing an arti for Karanjar every morning. So Baba, you know how I've always wanted to visit India? Please, please, I honestly, you have really spend my dream. Okay, I know what we should do. So ironic. Because also, I always assume that I'm gonna stay away from the Indian community on campus. I remember that. That mystery punch at that frat party. Oh my god, that was so long. We were such babies that we used to go to frat parties. No. Oh. No. Also, that reminds me. So, I was looking at the flight schedule and the films on it, and they literally had a zero volume movie. So, you know, I downloaded it for us. Let me show. Mm -hmm. Wait, why are we doing this? So Baba, you know how much I've been wanting to go back to India, right? Many log, many sanskar, and all of that jazz. Well, I think it's time to say that your little pre is not so little anymore. I'm going to India, Baba. <laughs> Yash, Aisha's brother. Even though he was raised in India, he has a startup in Seattle and loves the suburbs. And he's probably one of the most supportive brothers I've ever encountered. Hello. Oh my god. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Hello. Hi. Oh, you did this. Yeah, you heard we were coming and you flew in from Seattle. Aww. <laughs> Hi, I'm Free. Ram, nice to meet you. Uh, can I get you another drink? Yeah, I'll have another. Sure. Uh, two Achiros cars, please. Thank you. So, you're obviously not from here. Tell me about yourself. Well, I'm actually from LA, but I know all about Bollywood. I watch so many movies. God, please don't tell me you're one of those filmy, filmy types. No, I mean, I feel like I'm finally living the reality I never had in India. Oh, God, you are one of those types. Hi, Tina. Hi, how are you? You remember Karan, right? Yeah, hey, hi. What's up? I'm good. Babe, hey, let's get a drink. Yeah, okay. good to see you. Yeah, um, you too. Oh, guess who's here? Yeah, I saw you over there talking to the Wicked Witch of Malabar Hill. 
Oh my god, I couldn't be bothered about it right now. And of course, she's throwing my face at Karun's here. Ah, she's so irritating. And that look, oh my god. Oh. Look, she loves that she can get under your skin after all these years. Okay, so how about we go to Tris, have a good time, okay, get your mind off things. Hi, good hi. afternoon. Um, hi, sorry. Um, Who are you here for? Um, I'm here for Mr. Tree, Tree, Tree. Ah, Mr. Tree Gridiron, yeah. right. He'll be waiting for you in the room right there. Awesome, thank you so much. No problem. You? Is this a joke? Oh look, it's B3. Are you following me? No, you're my lawyer. You're Mr. Dukunati. Dukunati. Have a seat. So, it seems to be fate has brought us together again. Okay, uh, let's get this all figured out. Wow, um, I'm surprised you got this all prepared and got here on time. Looks like you didn't have too much fun after you left me last night. Oh, shut up, you were such a bore. I had so much, I would have so much more fun talking with my mom about yoga. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, do all lawyers go out to bars on weeknights and hit on their clients? I wasn't hitting on you. Okay. Okay, um, so this can be easily processed. All you need to do is sign here and here, and you can continue on your Pani Puri tour through India. That's it. I came all the way to India and found a lawyer for something I could have done in my ho own hotel room. I, I mean, it comes with some perks though. You met me, right? Okay, well, I guess this is good. It was a lot easier. Um, I left my number on the second page, so call if you need anything at all. Okay. And I will catch you next time I see you following me. Maybe I'll follow you tonight? Yao Chat 7? Maybe you will. Everything that Mama and Papa live for. So, how are you gonna live with yourself if you can't be honest with them? Yeah, but I don't wanna hurt them. See, I know they can be super irrational, irritating with their traditions. Yeah, but they're them, and I still don't wanna hurt them. Okay, I understand parents can be difficult sometimes, but what parent isn't difficult? Yeah, but okay, so here's the thing. Back in America, okay, I knew I had my freedom. I had my space. I didn't have to confront anyone. Already here, I feel like my life's been dictated by what Bina Andy has to think or Bhaskar Uncle has to say. But how, how are parents going to support this? Okay, first of all, Bina Andy makes the worst biryani in the entire world. And we still all have to eat it. So, whatever you have to say to Mama and Papa, I'm sure they're going to digest it eventually. You really think so? So trust me on this, okay? It's all going to work out. It's been fun hanging out with someone excited about every little thing. Oh my god, this is where Shah Rukh did this, and oh my god, this is where Ranbir did that. You know, I've never met someone like you. 
I'm sure you'll find someone like me back in the States. Believe me, I've tried. No one's basic enough for me. We connect so well. Oh, okay, you know we can't be together, right? I mean, you're from America. Why? Is that a problem? No, it's, it's just that it would never work. My parents would never ex accept this or you. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. So I finally found a brown guy I like, and the problem is I'm from America? No, it's not, it's not like that. My parents have always seen me with someone from here, someone who understands the lifestyle and the culture. The lifestyle, the culture, like how you have someone cooking for you 24-7 and doing your laundry? It's not like that, Pri. It's just that my parents want me to be with someone who understands the traditions and just the way the things are done, the culture, and the slang even, things that you don't learn, you just grow up with. And I can do my own laundry. Okay. Ram, you are a dignified and intelligent lawyer and you're still listening to your parents about your future? Come on! See, this is what I mean. To me, my parents' opinion matters. I can't just go do whatever I want, especially in terms of marriage. It's a family ordeal out here. So that's it? You're just gonna give up? I mean, you took me to temple. We're halfway there. <laughs> Priya, I think you're great, honestly. And it's just that I didn't expect us to get so close so, so quickly, you know? It usually takes me a lot of time to connect with someone, especially with a beautiful, cute, kind, intelligent girl like yourself. Okay, fine, let's just go. We need to get ready for tonight anyway. Okay. Hi. Hey. How are you? Good. Okay, so I need to update you on so much. So I talked today with Ram about our relationship, and I just don't... Relationship? Yeah, relationship. Explains why you guys are being attached by the hip. Okay, so he was telling me why our parent, his parents would never think we can be together, and it's because I'm too Americanized. Like, what the, what the heck? Um, also, what do you mean, attached by the hip? I mean, what I mean. I mean, since your first date, you've just been hanging out with him, and you haven't even noticed that I'm passive-aggressive about this. Wait, Aish, I didn't mean to ice you out at all. I mean, I'm here for you. Yeah, sure, because the places that I wanted to visit with you, show you around my high school, we haven't done any of that. And on top of that, you've visited all those places with him. Aish, I mean, I thought you wanted to be hanging out with all of your childhood friends. You haven't seen them in four years. I had no idea about any of this. Also, I mean, we have three days together in Janai. We're going to have a ball. We're going to have so much fun. And I really, really, really need your advice on this. I don't trust anyone else. You know okay. that. Okay, fine. Okay, tell me about this guy. I'm listening. Okay. Okay. Dear Baba, we just left Bombay and we're headed to Chennai. And just like a thousand gold pieces piercing my heart, Bombay has touched my soul. Its sunsets continue to tease my memory. The city makes my senses spin clockwise, and I'm caught dancing on a silver timeline till dawn. Also, Baba, remember when I was whining about love and all its tribulations? Well, let's just say I finally found a guy. And Baba say I hate. And the best part is, he's ready to do his own laundry. But I still have to blame both you and Mama for the ridiculously high standards you guys have put on love. Anyway, Baba, I'm, I'll get back to you later. I'm going to see what Jenna is all about. Actually calling me? Is everything okay? I'm doing well, I'm doing well. How are you? Everything is going well. 
I miss you. I miss you a lot. I miss you too, Mary John. How is your trip going? Are you finally living your Bollywood dream? <laughs> I am living my, my Bollywood dream. Um, I mean, it's been cool. It's been nice. It's been kind of memorable just by the fact that I've been going over everything. And I actually went and saw Dad's old place. And it was a lot of fun seeing that. And it brought up a lot of memories. Um, I also, I also met a guy. His name is Ram. And I don't know, he just reminds me of the way that you talked about dad. It was just so surreal. And the way that, the feelings that you got around dad was the same that I'm getting right now. And I just, I don't know what to do. The problem is, is that I, he says I can't relate to his culture and that I'm the problem. And I don't know, mom, I just need your help. You are who you are. Sometimes life throws these curveballs, but the key is to just face it as you are. Just let it all go. If it's meant to be, then he'll come back to you. If not, then it's not meant to be. There's nothing wrong with how I raised you, or our culture and values. I'm proud of you, and I know you will one day understand what I see in you. I love you, Mom. Okay, well, I will call you when I get back to Bombay. I miss you a lot. So, you know, Seattle is absolutely fantastic. It's a really nice change of pace from India. Um, but, you know, it's still got the hustle and bustle in the city, but the suburbs are just absolutely beautiful. I need to come and visit you with Aish. We'd have such a ball. You definitely should. It yes. sounds interesting. Yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's definitely a great time. Yeah. Uh, Guys, I just got off the phone with my parents. We need to go to Delhi. I need to speak with them. Why? What happened? We have a flight there in three days. No, um, so my mom's already started looking for guys. It's um, no pressure dating and she's not talking about engagement or, or anything like that. But it's time. I need to be there before it gets out of control. Okay, we can take a train up and then we can see all the same sites that we wanted to see and we'll reach a day earlier, right? Um, one second. Um, we are definitely not taking the train. No one's going to marry her off in like three days. Also, I promise you that long train ride is going to make you stress out more. Yeah, I know you. God, I'm so nervous. How are we gonna get through this? I'm nervous. Listen, they're your parents. They love you. I promise it'll be fine. I don't think you understand sort of how our family is. Uh, I sh I'll help you figure out exactly what to say, okay? And, you know, we'll, we'll figure this out, all right? Mm -hmm. And don't worry, I'll also be there. And then when you go back to the US, you won't have to hide anything anymore. And when you will be working and you'll have your mind somewhere else, it'll be fine. That's true. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me get this straight. So when we were over there um, at the bar and you and that Tina girl were fighting over this guy, you were never really interested in him. Oh, of course not. I was never interested in him. It's just that Tina and I have been the attention types and things just went out that way that night. Oh. I mean, I can think of a lot of people who give Tina attention. Yes. Yeah. 
Hi, Mama. Hi, baby. Good to see you. How are Mom. you? Oh. I shoot. Ah. You're home. Priya, how are you, Dad? How are you? I'm doing you well. Go. Hey, Papa. Yes. Oh, good to see you. How have you been? Good. I'm good. 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 So, Priya, Vita, how you been? I'm doing well, Uncle. How are you? Tell me how Bombay was. Okay, no, no, wait, wait. First, tell me who wants what to drink. No one wants anything you said. No, no, something. Anyway, coffee, anyway. juice. Look at leg. No, you're not going anywhere. Where's okay. Reshma? Let's tell you. Reshma Reshma never does any work. She always sits and watches TV. Why? 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 Oh, she went down. She went down. Beta, the boy that Priya found, what's his name? Ram. He's Ram. good? Yes. He's, really he's good? Nice. He's a lawyer. Who? Priya found a boy, he's a lawyer. Oh, so that reminds me. You know, ba Bhaskar? Bhaskar's oh. younger sister's nephew's younger sister's best friend is getting married. And that's Shahrukh Khan dancing at the wedding. Oh. That's so extra as you guys call it. But actually, why do people call actors on their weddings? They don't even know us or anything. Beta, we do your shadi with a lot of style, don't worry. Yeah, if there will be a wedding. What? The whole world will be playing. That's what you said. Of course, our son is. Yes, we can call Salman Khan too. Salman! Yash! Yash, you'll dance on your sister's wedding, no? Jesus, no. Ram, Beta, Ram. You should not go. Listen, um... I want to talk about something with you guys. Since a while. Um, I, Mama, I, I don't want to get married. Next year? No, Abhi, not even next year. I, I don't want to get married, Mama. No. Evo? Education, so marriage Abhi makes no sense. No, no, but beta, yeah. Full, you finish your education, finish your career, then get married. But, I... Married, but what? I, I... I don't like boys. <laughs> Beta, I know boys are very difficult to deal with, but marriage is a very important milestone in your life. You can't live the rest of your life alone. You have to live it with someone. You know, you know, what's her name? Gigi Kaki? Yeah, Gigi Kaki. You know, she didn't get married early and now in her 40s, it's so difficult to, you know? I, mean, I, I want a life partner. It's it's not that. Yeah, so so what's the problem? It's just that I, I, I don't want that life partner to be a boy. Acha, you want a man? Good. Nisha, look. Her daughter has standards. No, you guys, you're not understanding. I, I don't like boys. I like women. What? Aisha, what kind of games are you playing with us? I'm sorry, Dada. These are no games. I, I've been wanting to tell you this since a while. This is, this is who I am. What nonsense. This is not who you are. I'm not. You guys have all gone mad. Yash, you say something like that. First of all, don't jump to any conclusions. And second of all, this is a huge step for Aisha. Try and, try and be sensitive. Nisha, how did you get this child? I didn't get this child alone. Child, how are you going to have kids? Mama, there are alternative ways and I don't need a man to have a baby. Huh? This is all nonsense. Nisha? Aisha, you really hurt us. Please, this is who I am. What do I do? Yash, you knew this? Papa, try and understand what she's saying. She can't sacrifice her own happiness for you. Nisha, you don't say anything. Abhi, please, please calm down. Where is the respect? You guys are not my kids. And I, I didn't mean to hurt you. I. I didn't mean to hurt you at all. I've been I've been trying to hide away from it ever since my childhood and now when I'm accepting it I'm I'm actually very very happy. Please please understand. You guys are not my kids and I will not support this. I don't. Mama, please. Mama, kuch bolo, mama. Please. But Aisha, you're smart, healthy, young. Why are you throwing away your life like this? Aisha, Aisha, maybe maybe you're going through a phase. Maybe you haven't found the right man yet. You know, Sharia Aunty does a lot of spiritual stuff. Maybe maybe we can consult her to, to get you fixed. I'm not broken. This is who I am. 
This keeps me happy. Please. Please understand. I shall bus. Both will get it. Tomorrow, I have to go out in society. What am I going to tell them? But you guys never, never understand. Can you talk? Yeah. I'm sorry we shouted at you. It's just what you said, um, what you are. I, I, I. It's just not something I can accept. Ma, I'm sorry for not telling you this earlier, but I'm not gonna apologize for who I am. Sorry. I just want you to have a normal life. How are you going to have kids? How are you going to be treated in our community? How are you going to be accepted in our family? Ma You're going to have a very difficult life. No, I, I really don't care about all that. All that matters to me is you and Dada. And if you're happy, I'm happy. Aishu, when did you become such a brave girl? I don't know. That's the thing. It's, it's not an option or a kind of preference. It's really who I am. I surely fully understand. But your mom is right. The only reason we were worried and the way we reacted was because we were worried about your happiness. And it is going to be hard. But you're so brave and we have no worries about that. As long as you guys are with me in this, I have nothing to worry about. We'll always love you. Let's call it profile. Chalo. Why would I be complaining about more daughters anyway? <laughs> Hello. Hey, Priya. Hi, Ron. How are you? I'm okay. Just really missing the times we spent together in Bombay. Uh, I called to check in. Uh, how's the whole Aisha thing coming along? It's going pretty well, actually. She gave her parents a big shock, but um, 
they're taking it kind of well. They keep saying very insensitive things like the gays, but they're trying. It's sweet. Um, listen, I'm sorry. I, I don't know. I, I just, yeah, I, I don't know what to say. Um, yeah, of course. Um, so basically, I, I, I really thought about everything I said to you. And honestly, I think I just acted out. And it's just that I've never been so close to someone. And I, it's never happened so quickly. The whole thing made me feel very vulnerable. Ram, is this just out of a movie? No, I'm being absolutely honest with you. I really do like you. And I, I just want to give this a shot. I want to be there for you. And I, I want to know, how, how, how do you feel about that? Ram, I mean, you're kind of, you put me in a really hard position. I was really fond for you, but you, we are very different. And we do have to think about it. Okay, I mean, yeah, take your time. That, that, that's fine. Uh, See, I, I know my parents will support my decision, uh, I mean our decision, and I, I just want you to understand uh, that I, re I really want to give this a shot. Okay, well, maybe I'll catch you tonight following me. Maybe you will. Baba, I guess all's well that ends well. I can't wait to tell you about chapter two. Hey, Zindagi, tu hai badi haseen. I'm so immensely proud of the young woman you become and just I've learned so much these last few days and just continue to be yourself, do us proud and I'm so so happy for you and you're finally home. Nisha Mary Jan, a beautiful light. I'd be nothing without you. And I've realized that time and good friends, the two things that just become more and more valuable as you grow older. So cheers my friends. I love you. I love Girls like to swing. Cut. That was fine. Yeah. Back up. Back up. <laughs> 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 <laughs>